Hi, good day everyone. I'm Teresa C. Pungkol. Today, I want to react and the one most controversial and unethical advertisement of Philippines by Answer Peace, but three questions. First, why do you think the ad is ethical? Second, how it could possibly be received by a certain group? Third, why it could be a better way presenting the ad? Here are clips the TV ads and the one most carrier of the Philippines, Palawan Princess, Extra Padala, Arlozan, and it's all what you having no legitimacy, lawfulness, and legality. The sexist way in manipulate details to convince of consumer. Being provided the product service with a clips three host exchange. For how to declaim responsibility, get provided a platform adopted the Palawan Queen and reimbursement by instant, affordable, and convenient. Padala mo sa tatay ko. Right away, sir. Palamas! Wow! Ang bilis! Nakakaglit! Anak, tanggap ko na. Mabilis talaga. Thank you, anak ko. Kep! Bakit po? Silpe mo na. Sure. Dito na magsangra. Dito na magpera padala. Barato. Paspas. Walay hasul. Ipalawan mo na. Diyan. I believe a full-fetched advertisement has spread a lot good access value that can be made by accommodation and seductive, having scrupulosity. However, I think I better not from those becoming legitimacy. Therefore, even a young publishing company called Pain Mass Media and social media in order to obtain the value client state from ideas have greatly influenced by gradually gain legally and obligate to provide assistance how it could be possibly be received by a certain group to be presented the idea legally to the group to let these clients work in groups whenever possible a select group of clients has been invited to the conference and legitimate clients that has been initiated from having a showing assurance and self-reliance. How could be a better way of presenting the ad? I learned about the information from an advertisement brochure, sure player, mass media, and social media to make no opening of Right away, sir. That's all. Anak, tanggap ko na. Mabilis talaga. 